Designing a product is a complex task with multiple competing factors. Take designing a Formula One race car, for example. We have aerodynamics, safety of the driver, light weighting, and more to consider. One aspect of designing any physical product is choosing the material for the various parts. In our example of a Formula One car, we can have multiple objectives we want to optimize. Think minimizing mass, but also minimizing cost. But what about the ecological impact of the materials? What about the strength of the material? The stiffness? Selecting materials while optimizing multiple objectives is a challenge. Trade-offs are involved if one material candidate doesn't rise to the top. How do we deal with this in a logical way? In this ANSYS Innovation course on Advanced Material Selection, we'll be focusing on the challenge of selecting materials during design when there are multiple objectives that need optimizing. We'll be utilizing the Ashby selection methodology throughout this course and focusing on how we can utilize two performance indices on a single selection chart to help us compare multiple objectives with one another during our ranking stage. We'll also discuss strategies of how to assess trade-offs during design. And finally, we'll go through a case example of selecting the material for a car door panel using ANSYS Granta EduPack. But please note that you can also do this example with ANSYS Granta Selector. My name is Dr. Caitlin Tyler, and I'll be your instructor for this course. Thank you for joining me today, and let's get started.